Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to this video. I have literally just got home from going on a Mother's Day walk. Happy Mother's Day to everyone. Well, it's obviously a very delayed Mother's Day because this isn't going to go up on Mother's Day necessarily. Um, but yes, I hope all of your mums or if you are a mum watching this, I hope you had an amazing Mother's Day. But I literally just got in the door. And this parcel arrived from I'm Eco. Now, I'm Eco, I absolutely love them. They have always been amazing, so, so helpful, and just really, really nice. Um, so, I ordered a couple of things from there the other day. They're mainly actually for my mum and my dad, which is a bit crazy. I think there might be something in here for me. Um, maybe a couple. I think they put some samples in as well, which is really, really nice. Um, that's something that I absolutely love. They put like little free samples in and um, they just write like a little card and all sorts. So I thought we could sort of like open it with you. Um, so this is obviously what the box looks like. It's a completely nice box. Everything is all eco-friendly, vegan and vegetarian, which I just think is amazing. So you can, this is all like recyclable as well. So you can just chuck it all in the recycle bin once you're finished with the box and everything. So once you open it, you open it like this um, and it's all nicely wrapped up and it comes with a little card which says, thank you for your constant, constant support, Kira. We found our old sample of vanilla and sandalwood and put in put it in for you. Also a something sample in there. Enjoy Emma and Dan. They are the loveliest couple ever. So they are a couple, a very I mean quite a young ish couple, um, that created I'm Eco and they are just so so nice. If you go onto their website i think possibly instagram and all of that stuff as well um they have loads of information about who they are and what they do um and that they love it or whatever okay i'm now going to i can't really do that on camera but i have just oh i've just peeled this off so i'm gonna open it so then it looks like this so it's got all of these little biodegradable um what was it called like um peanuts is that what they're called i don't know okay and then in here oh oh there's a sample oh is that another sample that's a sample though i love the wrapping on that okay so Two of the things that I got actually for my mum and dad. So my mum and dad, or especially my dad, is not strict, but like he likes to use as many vegan products um, as he can. So when it comes to like hair, he uses shampoo and conditioner bars, which I'm going to try and get myself into. Um, so if you want to have started using them, if you want to know any more and how it's like working with my hair, I haven't got them yet. I've ordered them actually from a different brand, so I'm eco, I'm really sorry. Um, I just found some others that I really like the look of. But anyway, um, I ordered these. So these are deodorants, roll-on deodorants. They are eco-friendly deodorants. So we have um, Ylang, is that Ylang? And Rose. And we have Pachoili and Mango. So this one, oh, oh, I like that. How do you roll it? How does this work? I don't know how that works, but I think it rolls up. One second, I'm sure. Okay, the cat didn't want to come in. I'm not sure how you roll these up. I thought I had like a a roll bottom thing. Because surely, I thought you'd be able to like, I think you can push it up, but it's quite hard to do. Oh, maybe not. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> that's the Petroli and Mango one. Um, and then this is the, oh, I like both of these actually. They're not smells that I love. Like, I wouldn't want this in a candle necessarily, but I do like it. 
do like to use uh, I really don't know how you use this but that's really cool so once you have finished with these these are completely I'm hoping oh, um, recyclable yes 100% recyclable packaging are made from a natural ingredients so once you have finished using these these can go straight into the recycling bin which i think is just amazing um because like there's nothing better than doing that is there um okay and then another thing that's also this is for my dad i can't remember what scent was for um for who out of these two deodorants but the next one is a lip balm for my dad because my dad gets super dry lips and I have that problem sometimes as well, especially in the winter months when it gets cold. Um, so this is plastic free, affordable cosmetic. So this is a vegan la um, la lip balm. This is in orange and bergamot. Oh, wow, that is so nice. I'm like showing you, like you can smell it, but it looks really, really cool. Again, really cool because this I'm thinking once this is done you can possibly recycle it or you could keep it as a, like a cute little pot um, I do like the little pots like that I must say okay and then I ordered one of these so this is actually for me for when I have my bath so this is a um, facial steam blend plastic affordable cosmetics restore so it's like a so you like sprinkle it i think in the bath i think i'm gonna open it so we can smell it oh my god that smells so natural that's how it smells really like that's how we sounds really odd but it smells like the outdoors almost i don't know it's weird i like that though okay and then i also got this which is in the scent charcoal and gray something so this is a wax smell this is for my mom i am going to open it i'm sorry mom but i've opened it <laughs> oh i like that a lot Oh, I like that. It's quite subtle, but nice. I'm not a... Well, I like sweet scents, but I also don't sometimes. If it's, like, sickly sweet, then I really hate it. But when it's not, then, yeah. Right there. No. I feel like there's something else in here, but there isn't. So there's a sample of two things, I think. Oh well. So this is oh they're together. Maybe it's stupid. I love this love heart packaging. I can't open this. They have sealed it up very well, which is a good thing. Oh, how am I going to know which is which? I'm not very good with scents. Okay, so these are also wax melts as well. So if you have a wax melt burner, if you put this on top, it will just burn away. So one is vanilla and sandalwood. Oh, I love that. That is going on tonight. It smells like one of the candles I've actually got downstairs. Oh, I love them. Okay, so these are little free samples. Unfortunately, one of these they don't actually sell anymore, which is so unfortunate, and I'm really sad that they don't. So I can't actually link that in the description box for you guys. Um, I'm really sorry. Ooh. Um, and I think that was the vanilla and sandalwood one. Um, which I can't tell. So, um, I'm Eco. If you're watching, let me know if it's the blue, the blue one, or the grey one. Um. But yeah, I would like, I'd like to know which one is which. But I am very, very happy with this little order. Please do go and support I'm Eco. I totally recommend them. Um, they are the loveliest people I have probably ever heard of, spoken to. I've never, I'm not someone that, this is going to sound really, really bad because I am now. 
um but i'm not someone that's good with supporting little businesses normally um but i do love doing it now especially because i am vegan and we're all vegan in this house um i like to help vegan eco-friendly brands as well um that are really small businesses as well etsy and not on the high street are great places for that as well because they're all especially etsy as far as i know are all different individual brands but i'll put on etsy um which i think is amazing um so yeah please do go and support more small businesses instead of going on to amazon or instead of going into primark i mean that's slightly different i guess because it's a clothing store but yes i do highly recommend supporting little businesses especially i'm eco um you can go follow them on instagram facebook and also go go and check out their website if you just put i'm i'm eco dot <laughs> i'm dot eco dot retail um on instagram um and then i'm eco i'm slash eco dot co dot uk on for their website um i just i just love them so so much i am so so happy um this is my third or fourth order i think third order from them um and i'm definitely going to be ordering from there more especially for presents for people as well um especially like for my mum and dad and all of that stuff because my mum and dad love all of this sort of stuff um i'm getting so much more into it now as well i have ordered a candle from them in the past and i absolutely love it it's like my nice relaxing bath kind of self-care day candle if that makes any sense but i I'm loving supporting them so so much I actually the reason I think one of the reasons why they put samples in so I so if you live a certain miles away from where they produce all of this wonderful stuff that they sell to people um then you get free um delivery to your door um but also if you don't then you do have to pay a little bit but i feel like that's fair it's not much at all i don't think um so i did do that because it came up with the option um that i could because it, it didn't seem like cornwall almost and i'm not far from cornwall really obviously not 10 miles um but i so they messaged me really nicely i said oh i've just ordered from you and I've been I was messaging them at a day when I was trying to order stuff from them um, and then they said oh um, I've seen you've done deliver like home delivery free home delivery or whatever to the door um, and I was like oh yeah um, and they're like oh you are that little bit further than like 10 miles or whatever it has to be um, and so I was like oh okay that's all right then I mean, she was like, oh, are you okay just to spend like that two pounds more or whatever? And I was like, yeah, of course. So I actually gave them four pounds. So I gave them a little tip. I know it's not much, but it they were well appreciated it. And they were very happy. God, they were very happy about it. Um, And so I think that's actually why they gave me samples. Because they messaged me after that and said, oh, thank you so much. We'll put a little sample in there for you. I was like, oh, thanks. Um, but yes, anyway, I highly recommend checking them out. You can message them on their Instagram and say that I've sent you. Um, they will know who I am, I think. If you put in my Instagram name or my YouTube name, then they will definitely know me. Um, but yes, another thing that they were really helpful with. Um, so when I did my first ever video on me trying out all of their bath bombs and some of their bubble bars, I the box actually came all destroyed, like the one side, which was so gutting because it was such a lovely packed um, box and there was sellotape all over it and they try and not use sellotape. So I think the sellotape that's on it is like special paper kind of type of sanitape if that makes sense um and they were really gutted about it and they like spoke to them and i had to send pictures through which was fine um and they gave me some free samples and they sent me a free little turtle bath bomb which i absolutely adore i love their turtle bath bombs 
um, and a really nice vegan chocolate bar um, and all sorts. So they do do like different types of flavoured teas and um, chocolate and all of that stuff. So that's another reason why I recommend if you're a chocoholic, then recommend. Um, they do some amazing flavours, which I think is awesome. So anyway, I'm actually going to leave you guys here because I'm just rambling on about how amazing I'm Eco are. So definitely go check them out at imeco.co.uk um i yeah i'm just so grateful for all of the help that they have given me um and yeah please do check them out i shall um link all of their details in the description box for you i'll link their facebook their instagram and also their website for you and every single product that i have spoken about in today's video um so yeah Anyway, I'm going to love you and leave you now. Um, I do hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you did have an amazing Mother's Day. Um, also, just support your mum every single day because that's all I need. Um, and I will look forward to seeing you soon. Um, I'm sorry all of my uploads are very weird at the moment. I'm just not... I don't have any motivation at the moment to do anything. So... I am really sorry about that. I want to totally get into uploading more, but I think you're just going to have to expect them whenever. I will always let you know when I'm going to upload, though, so don't worry. Um, yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll let you know when I'm editing a video and all of that stuff, because I always do that on my Instagram. So please do also go follow me on my Instagram as well. Um, it will help me out a lot, um, and I will appreciate it so, so much. And feel free to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I shall talk to you all very, very soon. Um, and yeah, I love you and leave you. Stay safe, stay well, and... Keep smiling. <laughs> That's quite a good one, actually. Maybe I should just end all of my videos like that. Love you all.